Right, now I'm unboxing the Magnum Temptation chocolate ice cream today. Uh, it's quite attractive packaging, as you can see there. The silver really catches the light. And uh, now this is the Australian version of the Magnum Temptation, although made in Germany there, you can see, by Unilever. The giant Anglo-Dutch multinational company also responsible for Bovril, Slimfast Diet Products, and of course, Fair and Lovely, the leading skin lightening cream for Indian women. Now the principal ingredients are Belgian uh, dark chocolate, uh, this side says here, Belgian dark chocolate, brownies and white Belgian chocolate. Although let's not forget the uh, glucose fructose syrup emulsifier 407 stabilizers 410. Now it's 900 and 52 kilojoules, which is 11% of your daily energy intake, which I'm assuming means that 10 of these spaced out over the course of a day would satisfy your calorie needs, plus a little bit extra. Now the weight is listed as 68 grams per serve, uh, which is compared to 91 grams, the classic Magnum weight. Now I picked up this uh, model here for $4.40 from my local store. And the price of the classic has remained pretty steady at uh, $3.40. So essentially the consumer is paying a uh, dollar for approximately 25% less chocolate, but in a box. It's a clever marketing strategy there, which um, seems to be working quite well, on me at least. Right, so let's open this up. Uh, you can see there is a an image of a lock here on the box. Although it doesn't need an actual key, the security is pretty minimal. But for an ice cream, it's the step in the right direction. And I've put a little tab on the side here, but can't seem to get that off. So let's just uh, see if I can uh, see if I can get it. Actually, it's pretty good security, really. It uh, helps build the anticipation now oh, there we go <clears throat> right so i've got that off so that's the ice cream there silver inside the box it's quite chic makes for a lovely display case for the ice cream now it doesn't say so on the box but i did hear rumors that the temptation was bluetooth enabled um, so i'll just grab my phone here and just head across to bluetooth um, see, and uh, yeah, there we go, it's coming up, that's great. I might just check though and see if it works with the lid closed as well. Let's just, look, just close that down there, Let's see, yeah, yeah, it still does, that's great, that's really quite good. Alright, um, so onto the ice cream itself, now uh, get this open again locks come back down again so you can see it's got the uh, stick accessory included there the uh, standard stick accessory which is also uh, branded there with the Magnum brand which is great and it's got a good heft to it here you can see the uh, dimensions the dimensions in here this is uh, s uh, end to end here um, just in terms of scale, uh, this is the new Magnum Temptation compared to the uh, Magnum Classic, the uh, original there. And uh, this is uh, compared to a Wiimote and a light bulb, a Stanley knife, and a finger puppet alpaca called Guillermo. Right, so it um, does fit quite snugly in the hand there. It's um, quite comfortable. And I mean, you could slide that into your pocket or into uh, a bag if you needed to. You'd get away with that, although um, you probably don't need to because you've got the, um, the case here as a display case, which is, which is great. Um, now, there's actually, going back to the case, there's actually a, a corrugated piece of paper here, um, which is um, providing bit of uh, protection there. Now I think that's an addition from the earlier prototype that didn't have this and there was some bruising noted on the underside of the ice cream 
in uh, real world testing conditions. But you can see here this one underside remains pretty pristine and deliciously unblemished. So there you have it. That's the uh, Magnum Temptation unboxed. Uh, I've quite enjoyed this whole unboxing thing. So if you um, want to see more of my videos, then you can probably um, look on for the blog post and, and see all sorts of those for the next couple of weeks. Um, oh, mm, mm. And, then, and that's the, um, the uh, stick which is branded on both sides. It's quite classy. Yeah.